Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Taurus? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Whenever you come across this reading, I hope everyone is staying safe. How are y'all doing, Taurus? I love you guys. How are y'all doing? It is Friday, 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 Friday. Yes, it is Friday, baby. Absolutely. How are y'all feeling tonight? To new viewers, cross watchers, please come on in. Take what resonates and leave the rest for someone else. Reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. Listen, I don't know your life, so you're going to have to reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. <laughs> how are y'all doing? My, my goodness. It's Friday night. Mm -hmm. Yes, baby. You made it. You made it. I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here. All right. There are blessings. Always remember blessings, lessons, and confirmations in all my readings. All right. We're going to get started. Spirit guides, I ask you to give me clarity, understanding most of all. I need your protection. This is for Taurus. Let's see what's in your energy, Taurus. It is Friday night. It is Friday night or Friday evening. A lot of strength. Okay. A lot of you in your, in your power. Woo. A lot of you in your power, you, a lot of patience here. Tell me more, Spirit for Taurus. Oh, yeah, you your higher self. You're listening to your intuition. Way to go. You have learned how to manage your anger. <clears throat> Taurus, you're learning how to manage your anger because it's in the reverse here. I like that. So you got you got the strength card here. You got the patient card here. You're learning how to be patient. Some of you, you become, you have become your higher self. Some of you are doing a lot of meditation. Maybe, you know, your anger, you're trying to, uh, you know, uh, do something. You know, you're beginning to listen to, listen to your inner voice, listen to your inner self. Yeah, I feel like some of you, uh, when it comes down to your anger, you are, maybe you're going to anger management class or you, you feel as though that meditation Yoga kind of settles, you know, kind of helps you suppress a lot of emotions as far as your anger. Okay, you've been working on that. That's been going very well for you. Congratulations. You're also working on your patience. You're starting to listen to your your yourself. You're starting to listen, you know, you start to listen to the messages, okay? You 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 probably more in sync with 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 the spirit, with with animals. Okay, with the angels are, are talking to you. Like I say, this is here is your higher self. You have become your higher self. You could be doing a lot of meditation, you know. Musa, Musa. <laughs> Musa, Musa. Because, <laughs> honey, sometimes you got to say Musa. Because <laughs> some people make you almost want to step back out. <laughs> I try to take you out your character, baby. Out your character. It's like, Musa. Okay, okay, okay. Let me cross my heart because I don't want to do something I'm going to regret. <laughs> so I feel like you're, you are definitely working on that, Tars. You're working on uh, suppressing and being more patient and not so quick, so quick to... Uh, you know, so quick to anger, okay? Yeah, you're letting go of that. Yeah, that was right behind it. You're letting go of, of uh, so quick. Some of you uh, will snap in a heartbeat, okay? Some of you, <laughs> you know you had to work on your anger because it, 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 it missed positive thoughts and energy. It didn't, I, I, would, I would punch somebody in the face in a heartbeat. I didn't care. I had it. What? So... I feel as though, Taurus, that that's what you've been working on. You've been working on doing that. And so uh, you had to let go. You said, you know what, I got I to gotta stop allowing people to get me there, to take me there, okay? So that means that you, you most likely, some of you, not all of you, you had to let go of someone that kept triggering you, that kept bringing that, that side of you out. And you said, uh-uh, this ain't going to get it. Or you realize that every action doesn't need a reaction every action does not need a reaction you're learning that and that is the truth okay once you have started become your higher self okay becoming your higher self you realize that every action don't need a reaction they, they you you just don't even pay them no attention you walk away you don't even you, you know not let's say just continuously just keep jabbing at you and then you gotta fight back you gotta fight back okay 
So I feel as though that you're definitely, you know, working on that anger, okay? Uh, you're letting it go. Uh, some of you, you know, you're listening to your intuition. The angel guys is telling you maybe you had a had an argument with someone or you got into it, a bad feud with someone. And I feel as though that this is for some of you that the spirit guys, the angels uh, came to you and told you to let it go. It, it ain't worth it. And so you had to just let it go. It wasn't worth your time, okay? Because I feel like I just seen this card right here that some of you, some of you wanted to punch somebody and knock them on their back. Okay, uh, that's how mad you felt that you wanted to really just knock somebody off their feet. Okay, and I feel like God or whoever your higher source said, "Calm down. I need you, Musa. I need you to calm down." So if it wasn't for you, a lot of you, if it wasn't for you being your higher self. Uh, and, and learning how to control your anger, cause learning how to control your temper, uh, this person would have been on their back, okay? Or people would have been on their back. So, so you had you had to you had to definitely let that go. You had to walk away from that. You had to learn how to tame the beast within you. Spirit guys, tell me more for Taurus. Yeah. So, um, I get another one. I'm not feeling that. Another card, Spirit guys, for Taurus. Okay, this inspiration. Yeah, flowers is here. Be generous. Okay, success and emotional fulfillment are yours. Okay. Thank you. Dragonfly is here. Have confidence during this time of great joy, uh, renewal, and connection to spirit. Okay. So if some of you have been seeing dragonflies, yeah, uh, that is definitely significant. Flowers as well. I feel as though that uh, someone may be generously giving you some flowers. Or this just means emotional fulfillment, okay? One more spirit for Taurus. Let's see what else. Oh, that's too many. Okay, Wish is here. So... And celebration is at the bottom of the deck with luck as well. I don't call, I don't say luck, I say blessings. <laughs> blessings. So you got wish, you got celebration, and you got luck here. All three cards. Four leaf clover. Touch a four leaf clover, baby. Okay. Yeah. Your way. Here I am. I am free. <laughs> okay, so and some of you may, you know, see a four-leaf clover, or you may have come across a four-leaf clover, but that is meaning that you're strong and optimistic about the opportunities that lie ahead. But your wish, your heart's desire is ready to come true. It's time to celebrate. I feel like Spirit Guys is saying there is about to be a big celebration. You're you're you are ready to bring in new exciting things into your life. So Spirit Guys say you're ready. You have become your higher self. You have learned how to tame yourself. You have stopped allowing people actions to make you react. I think that was the biggest challenge that you had. The biggest challenge that you had was to stop um reacting to all actions. Okay? So you had to really work on your your um, your anger issues. That's for some of you, okay? Let's get a spiritual. You're very powerful, Taurus. Very powerful. Tell me more, spirit guys. Thank you. Perspective. Yeah, you had to change your perspective. <laughs> you had to become your higher self. It's like Miss Paulson Thoughts and Energy. People don't realize I am not the same person I used to be because they don't realize I'm not the same person I used to be. Honey. I, 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 the person you see before you, you like, oh, honey, I would knock your lights out. <laughs> I would knock your lights lights out. I didn't care. Okay, I didn't care. So I can understand where this is coming from. You had to change your perspective. You didn't. You had to change how you see. Like, hmm. Is this person, does this person, is they worth me reacting to what they say? Because people going to say what they want to say. Okay. Can I stop that? This is a free world. They're going to mouth off, but I can. I can't separate myself. I can separate myself from these people. I can separate and I can change my perspective because every action doesn't need a reaction. And it doesn't. It doesn't. 
So it says, each day I hold a higher vibrational perspective towards all that is in my life. All that is in my life. You said this ain't worth it. I got to let this go. Because your anger can get you in trouble. Your anger can make you, make you do things that you will regret. Will regret. So perspective is here twice. You had to become your higher self. Double confirmation, two different decks. You had to become your higher self. See the card say higher self? <laughs> you had to change your perspective. If not, honey, uh, uh, yeah, somebody was going to have a bad day. Somebody going to be laid on the floor, on the ground, whatever you, however you want to put it. Somebody was going to be, somebody was going to be laid flat, okay? So, it, you know, you had to change your perspective. Here, guys, tell me more. For Taurus, tell me more. Woo, relationships, exactly. You had to, you had to. Relationships can mean anybody. It could be a lover, it could be a friends, it could be family. Anything that you interact as a relationship. I am surrounded by relationships of love, harmony, balance, abundance, and much more. I feel like the people that you're surrounded by, you're surrounded by a lot of positive energy around a lot of loving people, around a lot of people that makes you, you know, uh, that keeps you cool, calm, and collective. You know, and it matters when you, you when you're around those type of uh, 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 positive energy people that you know. Because if you was around a bunch of negative people, guess what happened? You be out there, <laughs> you be out there fighting, right? So you're surrounded by loving people, harmony, balance. You know, people that keeps you sane, <laughs> keeps you sane. Because remember, we are human. We are in the flesh. So when you know it's something that you know you have to work on when it's come down to your anger, you got to, you got to musta, musta. Oh, spirit guys, God, I need you to, I need you to, I need you to suppress this old person. I need you to <laughs> suppress her, suppress him because they don't want, they don't want to see that side of me. <laughs> ain't it so glad, ain't it so good to know that you can, you have control of how, how you don't allow anyone to make you overreact, okay? Allow. And it says, I allow abundance to flow into my life each day from limitless opportunities uh, 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 and circumstances, okay? So, <clears throat> by, by doing that, respond too. By doing that, you, by, by not allowing these the negative entities... Or people to make you step outside of yourself. You learn how to, okay, tame the beast within you. And you surrounded yourself around a lot of positive people that, that, that you know, that you know won't trigger you. So sometimes we got to remove ourselves from a situation, from so-called friends that they we thought, or relationships that made you want to step out of current character. You want to just, you know, do something that you're going to regret. Some, you had to realize that you got to remove yourself from that type of energy. When you removed yourself from that type of energy... 333 three, three just came up on the screen. 1333. Three, okay. When you allow, when you step back and stop allowing your anger to react to everything that somebody said or did, that's when you started to allow abundance. You allow uh, uh, the flow of positivity into your life. Okay. The response, living in the now. Okay. Responding to now, how you are now. You put the power of now into action each day. Okay? I respond to all situations, circumstances, events, and people with unconditional love, integrity, and excitement. You have turned, transmuted all that into love and light. You have transmuted that like, respond. You still say, well, you have a good day. You say, well, okay. Okay, you ain't the same person you used to be. Uh, put in there, put in that comment. Miss Paulson thoughts me energy. I am a total different person. I'm not the same person I used to be. Okay. So you had to let go of people that triggered you. You had to let go of people that caused you to step out of yourself. Okay. Spirit guys, tell me more. Yeah, you you had to let those people. You you had to come. You had to you had to do some some meditation, some yoga. <laughs> 
you definitely had to do that sore so you got um you got sore here now you're soaring above them now you're not down there of uh, uh uh you know uh, uh doing all that unnecessary stuff arguing fighting and 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 all that low vibrational stuff you now you're above above all of that you're soaring above that and it says you're being asked to stop dimming your own light period it's time for you to uh come out of the shadows and let your authentic self fly high dear one so i feel like when i intuitively see this card the soar is like you above the mess you above the drama you're above that. You're not at that frequency anymore, okay? Uh, you, you're not bad. It's not that you're saying I'm better than anybody else, but I'm not operating from that level anymore because if I'd have stayed in that level, Miss Positive Thoughts and Energy, I'll be in jail. <laughs> I'll be in jail. <laughs> I love you guys. It's the truth. It's the truth. Tell me more, Spirit guys. <laughs> So you had to, yeah, you had to release and stay grounded, okay? And you had to learn patience. It's right here. You had to release that and stay grounded, okay? You had to learn what grounding is all about. You had to release that. My goodness, ain't that something? It says you're being asked to release any toxic people. I can't make this up. Any toxic people or situations from your life. It says you deserve to be free from all drama, Okay, if you haven't got there, Spirit God said, I need you to start working on that. If you ain't Miss Paul Stoss in, I'm still. Well, you need to go into meditation. You need to ground yourself. You need to separate yourself from those toxic people that's making you step outside of your character. Okay, because it's only going to get you in trouble. So it says, um, and this is the first step to achieving that is releasing those people. It's right here. Letting go, being, being asked to release any toxic people or situations from your life. Screen shoot it. It's right there. Y'all got it? Okay. Now, grounding. You had to learn how to ground yourself, learn how to be centered, centered with yourself. Every action doesn't need a reaction. You learned that. And see, sometimes people say things and, and do things to you just so you will react. Some people know that, you know, you ever being in a, when you was in a low vibration, it's like, it's like whoever you could, you could be in a relationship and that partner just know what to say. And it will, it will, boy, you will flip off the handle. Okay. Triggers, triggers, triggers. You know, some people do it just to see your reaction. And then when you stop reacting, they look crazy. Like, oh, you know, yeah. Cause you, you, <laughs> yeah, you on a different level. So it says, you're being asked to ground yourself, Taurus. You've been spending too much time in your head, and it's time to pay attention to your body and to the earth. Go outside and plant your feet on the ground and enjoy the centering feeling this brings. So some of you may be in a relationship. Like I say, some of you, you have worked on this. Some of you still going through this. You're learning how to... And so spirit guides is saying, if you're in a relationship and this person always triggering you and it's like, it's always, they're making you step, go outside, barefooted, step in the ground, give yourself 20, 30 minutes so you can be back centered. Okay. Because you know, that's going to teach you how to start to center yourself. It's how to start to come, you know, to come to yourself, calm down. Yeah. Calm down. And uh, realize that, you know what, all this person wanted to do is make me react. What they're saying to me, what they're doing to me, make me want to react. They know what it would take for me to. And if this person keep doing this, Taurus, masculine energy, phantom energy, it doesn't matter. If they keep doing this to you, it's time to remove yourself from their life, period. This is toxic. It's time to remove people from your life that's toxic, okay? And patience. You got patience here twice. You're learning how to be patient with yourself. You're learning how to be patient. You're learning not to react to everything. Okay? Being patient with yourself. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that part right there. Okay? Some of you can be mad at your own self. Beat your own self up. Okay? 
mad at your own self, being hard on your own self, you know, being mean to yourself. That's what this card is saying. It says you're being asked to practice patience right now. It's not all it's not it's not easy to do this, but you're strong. And there's a reason why things aren't aligning in the way you want them to at this moment. Have patience, it will eventually work out. So having patience and believing in that things will get better, okay? So let's see what's going on. Spirit got thank you. Boom. Yeah, some people had tower moment here. So people had to fall off. These toxic people had to fall off. It was time to release. You got the tower moment here. Okay? Yo, you, yeah, it, your foundation had to be rocked. People had to... Spirit, guys, if you wonder why people start falling out your life, those people were really triggering you. Those people were very toxic. Those people really wasn't for you. You didn't see it. You was trying to keep them. But Spirit, guys, God, whoever your higher source... It said, no, they had to go. It was time. You you wasn't willing to release them. You wouldn't realize that, that they were the one that was making you step outside of your character. And so, therefore, spirit guys, God had to knock them out your life. I can't make this up. I'm trying to tell you. Anger. Anger is dangerous. Having, a, having anger issues is dangerous. It's like, it's like a person is a ticking time bomb. Wait for somebody to say the wrong thing and baby, you don't know that must, that choice that you make at that particular time will cause you, can cause you your life. Sometimes it's, you just have to walk away. I don't know who this is for, but sometimes you just got to walk away. And a lot of you did just that. You're single. You're looking good. Ever since you started meditating and, and, and becoming your higher self, look at, look at ground that you are. A lot of hurt. A lot of hurt. A lot of hurt and pain you've been through. But now your justice is here. Spirit guys, tell me more for Taurus. Mm. Let me see what that card. Yeah, you moved away. This could have been a baby mama, baby daddy. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But you moved away into calmer waters. Now, look at good you're looking. You're looking good. You're grounded. You feel good. You, you, you just... You, you at peace. <laughs> you at peace. This could be a baby mama. You had that baby daddy. You had to release him. You had to release him. Yep, look at that. Ten of pentacles, baby. Ten of pentacles. Now your life is fulfilled. I don't know who you are, but somebody about to come into some money. That just dropped into the energy. That just dropped into the energy. I see money all around me. I think I am the man. I don't know the words, but that's what some of it. Ten of Pentacles here. I'm your confirmation. Ching, ching, baby. Ching, ching. Hey, ching, ching. Hey, hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Ten of Pentacles. Some of you, finally, you get ready to get your, your settlement. Some money coming to you, a payout. Some type of payout coming to you. Okay? Something's coming. Your wish, your desire. It's on its way. It is coming. All right? Luck, blessings. Keep staying optimistic, okay? Four leaf clover. Because spirit guys, God is saying, this was a hard lesson for some of y'all to learn, which was about your anger. But before you got this, before this blessing or this wish that you wanted to come into your life, you had to go through this lesson of uh suppressing your anger you had to go through every action doesn't deserve a reaction you had to spirit god said i had to teach you that i had to teach you that because that is what's your the journey that you're about to go on you're gonna have to learn how to be patient you're gonna have to learn how to be patient and your wishes is about to come true yep you had to release this toxic energy. This was someone, it could have been a Capricorn. I intuitively see a Gemini. doesn't necessarily mean that. That's just what this card represents. But you had to release some toxic. Okay? You had to release somebody you was codependent. It kept triggering you, maybe verbally. One, yes, you know, have you ever been in a relationship? Men, I'm talking to men that, you know, man or woman. But I'm particularly talking to a masculine energy that that woman just yap, 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 yap. And it just make you just want to just... And then the woman will hit you. Women women abuse men. Women abuse men. 
women abuse men and it make you just want to and you had to release this toxic energy it ain't always the woman it's the man too yeah a lot of lies on you a lot of stealing a lot of everything you had to you had to you had to release these type type of people now now spirit guys god say now you can go on your on your day now you can go to your destination because the wheel is about to start turning in your favor you are destined for this blessing i don't know who you are but you are destined for this blessing the king of the knight of cups you are destined for this blessing your wishes is about to come true your wishes is about to come true yep there it go five of swords in the reverse letting go of those negative energy people yep Letting go of your ego, you know, taming yourself, letting <laughs> taming the beast, letting go, being around negative energy people. Yeah, you had to let it go. You learned a lot. This was a lesson that you had to really learn about your temper. This common denominator is all about your temper. Okay. Spirit guys, tell me more. If yeah, Russian. You got this Russian, yeah, this, you, Russian, somebody, yeah, you about to be, oh, somebody, oh, 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 okay, all right, Taurus, I'm trying to tell you so many messages came out, so whatever this blessing, whatever this is, uh, that's coming out for you, is Russian, this is going to happen for some of you, everybody's on different timelines, this may have already happened, this is happening for some of you, some of you, this is coming in your near future, you got your money coming, it's coming in fast, some of you, you may have already, uh, you already got your money, but it's coming in fast. This blessing, this very thing you've been waiting on, you've been patient, trying to be patient. Maybe you was angry about somebody messing with your money and you ready to go off. Okay, whatever it was, whatever it is, uh, it's coming, it's, it's arriving. It's going to put you back on your feet, ten toes down. I see money all around me. <laughs> yeah, some of you partnership some of you got a soulmate coming in okay you're gonna learn the truth that somebody's coming into your life with a true cup okay with a true cup this person may have already arrived in your life hey congratulations but baby let me tell you something spirit guys god had to put you in a place to to uh yeah you had to walk away and leave a lot of people out in the cold i'm so proud of you baby i'm so proud of you i'm so proud of you because yeah, you had to, you had to walk away. You had to learn how to tame the beast within you. Congratulations. Now, the very thing you've been patient about, you've been wanting to come, it's coming in and it's coming. Whoever stole, cheated from you, cheated you. Okay. Uh, Yeah, it's coming in. Get ready. Until next time.